tonight we're going to be experiencing the nightlife here in Saigon. It is super crazy and hectic right now. We have come to the Boy Vien walking street you can see here. It is a Saturday night so things could get pretty hectic. Uh, Boy Vien street is a very touristy street that a lot of the people come as first time tourists here to experience the nightlife here. So it looks like there's plenty of places to eat here. And actually it's very beautiful, very lit up. You can see all the lights here. We got people shouting at us to come into their restaurant and bar. I've also seen that. But uh, you got quite a few restaurants over here. On either side actually. <laughs> and uh actually the first impression is not that negative no like uh i've seen some videos online and i was like oh do i really want to go to this street it seems a little bit too uh i don't know like kind of strange and weird but uh we have uh live music over here on the left if you want to avoid the weirdness Maybe it's best to come early in the evening. Yes. You can see there's still lots of motorbikes going around. And it's I, actually very loud. <laughs> yeah, very loud. I'm having to kind of project my voice, shout a little bit, but uh, you can see flashing lights everywhere. This is like, must be a bar. I feel like I'm in a nightclub right now. Literally, but this is a nice time because it's still kind of relaxed and calm. Early on, not I, crazy. I can imagine later on in the evening things get a bit weird and uh, yeah, I, I think things probably get pretty weird over here. But uh, you can see there's a lot of tourists. Oh, did you see my frame? Oh <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so it looks like someone's spitting fire here. And uh, there's lots of sports bars. So if you want to come watch the football or cricket, but uh, we've got uh, again more restaurants and I reckon these people are going to try and uh, persuade us to come in. Uh, hello, xin chào. Xin chào. And uh, wow, check this view out guys, look at this. It looks like clubs on either side. This is mental. I'm actually quite enjoying it. You can dance on the street. Yeah. Apart from the motorbikes, you still got yeah. motorbike action coming through. I guess it turns into a walking street maybe a little bit later on in the day. Actually, I, I'm actually quite enjoying this. Your senses, your kind of feeling the, I mean, the energy. Yeah. Feels really good. But like I said, when things, people start drinking, when things start getting weird. It would be madness. Yeah, yeah. Not, not our type of scene. So it's nice to be coming at this time. And again, Xin chào. <laughs> come into our restaurant and then he saw the camera and it was like uh they gave me a weird look but you can get like fruit uh over here some kind of like little street food offerings i do think uh the drinks here will be super expensive because it's like a tourist area and i think the food will be i don't know I, I think you can get much better food off the walking street i think this is more catered towards the tourists you can see like literally just there on my left Everyone is just uh, tourist here. You won't find probably many locals coming here. <coughs> we don't even need to turn the camera off right now because there's content everywhere. The lights are just insane. Yeah, and there's <laughs> one club next to the other. Yeah. It's crazy. And uh, this is Koi Minu. I don't know what this is. Looks like, um, what is this? Oh, it smells uh, sweet. Sweet. Do you want to try one? 
Should we get uh, uh, how much is this? Uh, one is uh, okay. Let's try it out. So uh, <laughs> next to the club, hey, <laughs> we're having uh, some kind of street food. Why may I come on? Are oh, you showing you thirty thousand? Thirty thousand, Carolina. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so uh, we're still getting a hold of the currency here. There is such big change. There you go. That's hundred thousand. So when you have an opportunity to try something you don't know, why not? So we have this package which looks like some peanut and sugar. It smells like peanut. I think think, let's just pour it all over there, yeah. And I'm wondering actually what kind of like vegetable or starch this is. Alright. We have like two. Alright, go for it. We got like toothpicks so we can actually like uh, eat it. Alright, let's give this a go. vegetable that is uh, kind of like I don't know how to explain it, like potato-y mm -hmm. and then you add the uh, peanut and the sugar and it gives it like the sweetness to it actually quite delicious I think it's time to leave because my throat's not gonna survive this and Carolina is getting a headache to be honest, it's uh, everyone's trying to get us into the bar or into their massage parlor uh, or the restaurant and uh, yeah, it's not really our cup of tea. We like just to kind of relax, go to a nice local place to eat. And it's so and, much uh, to do. Sit down. <laughs> and, uh, and you were saying sorry? But it's so much Hello. to do during tonight. Yeah, yeah, like to be honest, like a lot of tourists come to this part, but there's so much to do in Saigon at nighttime that hopefully this video will show people that there's more to Saigon than Boy VN Street. And obviously you'll see like, hello. <laughs> A lot of the uh, Western people are like interested in uh, me filming here. But uh, yeah, like it's actually more kind of, in my opinion, a little bit more stressful just being here because we can't have a normal conversation. Yeah. This part of Boy Van Street is actually quite nice and bearable because it's not super loud uh, music. You have people eating in restaurants just sit here. I really like that lamp Oh, watch out. Oh my God, these, these motorbikes are crazy. Yeah, they scare me. <laughs> and the lanterns over there are really beautiful. Uh, but yeah, like the, the motorbikes, I don't know. Uh, this has got people shouting random stuff at you but this part is a lot more nicer and if you're just coming for some food and maybe it's your first night and you don't really know what to get then this is not a bad place to be at the, this side of the Boivian Street here's our uh, cassava guy I think okay guys so we have come five minutes away from Boivian walking street gonna be careful of all the traffic and we are coming this way so when you see this big uh, Oh, thank you. When you see this area over here, California Active is just here. There's actually really good street food options, plenty of food on this uh, area, away from the kind of, in my opinion, a little bit of a tourist trap, which is Boy Vien Walking Street. So, if we just come around here, you can see it's very lively, it's Saturday night. This place is always frequented by the locals, so we've come to Ban Mi Ba Hun. We've made a friend, guys. Uh, we have a YouTube channel. I'm a stuff. Oh, I'm a stuff. Yeah. It's okay. Okay. Oh, you're oh, your stuff here. You're working here. Yeah. Ah, okay. I thought you were in line for uh, as a customer. <laughs> I can uh, show them making the bread. Yeah. It's okay. 
Okay, so I will sneak through here. So over there guys, they are uh, baking the bread fresh. And they've got like a production process just here. And we have a massive queue behind us. So we will sit there? Yes. Okay, so for Okay, we can actually sit next door. Yes. Alright, so we're going for a big bar me and we can actually sit just uh, next door. Looks very spectacular. Oh, look at this. Yeah, they got the uh, like a production line going. Sometimes I'm like tempted to go behind the scenes and uh, see what they're doing, but they seem very busy, so I don't want to kind of get into their space. This one's ours, okay. Yes. All right. Okay, 67,000. So, usually Balmies we've been having around 25,000? Yeah, the cheapest ones. The cheapest ones. This is the most expensive Balmie that we've had, but it's a big one. So, this should be uh, enough to feed both of us. And we've got it here actually. It's huge. Oh my god, it's so big. All right, come on. Thank you so much for your help. Okay, so you can see actually all the delivery riders uh, or drivers are uh, waiting for their order here. Carolina's just come uh, over here. Wow, we've got a really nice seat. Right. All right, Bank of England. There you go. She looks after all the money. And this is actually a really nice seat. So what we love here in Vietnam is that you can just take a seat down on these little chairs and then you can just watch the world go by <laughs> I don't know, I just love the bike here <laughs> A lot more locals here compared to tourists You do see an odd tourist here but not so much Alright, let's uh, crack into this uh, bar me Oh, it's so big It's actually like the size of my forearm it's literally the size of my forearm, oh my god. Okay guys, so this is the inside of our bar meat. It is loaded with meat and also vegetables there. So let's give this a first bite. Oh my god, it's so big. I can't even put it into my mouth. There's a strong taste of the pate mm -hmm. straight away. The pate is darker. Got it stuck in my teeth. Mm. It's a darker uh, pate, so it's more kind of a real kind of rich, like meaty pate flavor. And then you're kind of got loaded with the meat. But unfortunately, on the first bite, I always have this problem. I, I tend to eat like not the best part, so let's give this another go. It's actually crazy because there's pate, there's chicken and there's some ham. <laughs> Losing the precious vegetables. Oh, oh my god, so good. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of butter as well, maybe that's why it's good. <laughs> the combination of the smoothest of the pate, the rich kind of meaty flavor. The pork and the meat inside of there, it's really soft and like kind of fatty. And then you have the freshness of the uh, the vegetables, super delicious. It's crazy how how cool it is, it's like what? So our bellies are now full with the bar me. I just want to show you the place so again so that you know where to come to. It's uh, Madame Wynn and our friend here, very good. Thank you so much. <laughs> bye, thank you. Bye bye super friendly they uh, really helped us out they we only had one like kind of wet napkin and uh, I needed to clean my hands because it was just full of like the pate and the bar meal and uh, Carolina used the first one come on my left side Carolina because the lighting on this side is not as good yeah but um, the uh, wet wipe they saw that and they came over and gave us a wet wipe yeah. and then the rubbish at the end they just took it from us yeah. so very good service there so thoughtful. okay guys we have spotted a sugarcane place just there so i think we're gonna cross now and there we go good job carolina you can see they've gone through a lot of sugarcane so literally the entire floor is covered in sugarcane all right uh all right xin chao uh one sugar cane? Xin chào. Yeah, one. So this is the sugar cane and you put it into right. there. Ah, so you put it inside of there, okay. And then it, this is what happens. Okay, so you can put the sugar cane through right now. 
just going to keep pulling it through because there's a lot of juice in there. He's actually putting a lime, I think he put a lime in there. Or maybe even an orange. I don't know if he put a lime or an orange. Looks like hard work. Actually repeating the process. And then you end up with this pile here. Oh, they got the Rao Ma here as well. Penny Word Juice Special. Okay, uh, how much? 10,000. Uh, 10,000. I uh, will give you that one there. <laughs> Come on. All right. So, should we give it a go? We've got ni nice lighting here. Oh, very nice. Very good. Mm -hmm. mm. It's sugar cane, so it's super sweet. I always say the same thing every time I have sugar cane. Can we give it a go? It's super refreshing. And when it's so hot here, it's like on its nighttime and it's still, I, I feel like my sticky sweat. Yeah. Do you like it? I don't know if it's the smell of the orange or if there's a little bit of orange here. <laughs> so when they're putting it in through the machine over here, they actually, I saw him adding, I think either a, a lime or an orange okay. piece at the same time when he's squeezing it's, it through. It's such a nice combination actually. So it gives it like a scent of the like orangey flavor, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Like a citrusy flavor. Super good. So in the same area, you'll see all of these food stalls just over here. So the entire area, you can come get really good cheap food. So you'll yep. find much cheaper prices in these stalls here. So. Over here, you, they have uh, Kom Tam. Hello. They have uh, Kom Tam over here. And uh, this one is super good. We've had it a few times and they grill the meat just over there. And then they pair it up with uh, like, it's called broken rice. So like kind of, you can imagine it, broken rice. And then you can get some fresh fruits here. You can get Bun Bao. And then there's this actually, which uh, I don't know, it looks very interesting. I think this is something that we've got to try at some point, Carolina. What do you think yeah. it is? I think it's some sort of a dessert, I it's know. It's some kind of dessert. They've got like... Uh... It's just like a drink. Yeah, it looks like... Well, there's some... <laughs> it looks like there is uh, vegetables, but it also looks like it could be sweet. Well, to be honest, I have no idea what's that one. Yeah. And then over here, this is, uh, I think, like a fried radish. So this is like a fried radish. Xin chào. Yeah. And this is like a fried radish. From this place, I had a meatball soup yesterday with the glass noodles. And how much did that cost you? I think thirty-five thousand. So pretty, uh, pretty cheap then. Yeah. So this is the night view here in District One, Saigon. So many motorbikes; they dominate the road here, and this will be going on all night. It's like that, pretty much. It's gonna be careful of the road. It's like that all the way throughout the day. Well, Carolina, what is it time for? For the dessert. It's time for the dessert, so we spotted just around the corner from here. Literally, <laughs> it's not hard to find uh, food here. Okay guys, so I've got a Google Translate and I've put in which one is the best. Let me ask. Xin uh, Hello. This one? So he's frying, the this one's the best one. Okay, I'm gonna go for pork inside. Pork inside. There's yeah. pork inside of this. Ah, the fried pork dumpling. Okay, this one is fresh. Uh, maybe I should be trying. I wanted a dessert, but it looks so good. Okay, I will try uh, one, one. And uh, you still want to go for the steam cake and the uh, bun bowl. Uh, bun bowl. Bun bowl. This is over there, yes, one. So you can see, guys, very hot frying pan there. He's using the chopsticks to kind of cook them and like kind of make them, make sure they're evenly cooked. You can see they're kind of like rising. Hello. <laughs> oh, oh, that's great, yes. He's my friend. <laughs> You're my friend. <laughs> I think that was, I think that was directed at me, Carolina. <laughs> I'm blushing right now. Okay, now it's teamwork, teamwork. There's uh, two of them. <laughs> and she smells uh, quite sweet, actually. Uh, oh, you wanna, Carolina's trying to take the phone out of my pocket because uh, she wants to do Instagram. Xin <laughs> chào. Hello. Hello. 
<laughs> Where are you from? Uh, I'm from England. England, là nước Anh England, yes. Ah, uh, Poland. She's yeah. from Poland. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you from Saigon? Saigon. From Saigon, okay. Vietnam, Vietnam. I love your England. You love England? <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Okay, so they're pork buns. They're pork dumplings, actually. I think they're ready. He's putting the fresh pork dumplings in there. These are like sesame rolls here. Green or white? Yeah. Green or white? Uh, you want green or white? Uh, maybe green one. Green one, green. Green. So this is, uh, what is this? Uh, rice cake. Steamed rice cake. And then we'll have one of these pork buns. When they're fresh like that, I like to have them. Yeah, yeah fresh. Fresh, fresh. Yeah. Okay, uh, 16,000, 16, nice. All right, come on. Come on. All right, so uh, I think we need to find a spot to eat them. We could actually probably eat them here. So I'm gonna try this rice cake. I think there's pandan flavor. Oh, that looks really soft. Mm. Is it like jelly-like? Mm -hmm. Very kind of like... It's like spongy and jelly in the same time. What and does it taste like? It's sweet. It's sweet, mm. but it's green. So is it like got pandan or anything in it? I would say so, yeah. It's like pandan flavor, but also a little bit of rice. I don't know. It's very nice though. Okay guys, it is time to try this pork dumpling. It is absolutely steaming in my hand. We have more customers here, so it's a popular spot. Let's try and not burn myself while we eat this. Mm. Very hot. I was a little bit worried because it looks quite fried and kind of processed, but the ingredients inside of it are really fresh. You've got the onions, the vegetables, the pork, the egg. Super delicious. This is absolutely madness, guys. Absolutely mad. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Slow down, Carolina. Got to take it slow. Put your hand out and take it slow. That's how you do it, guys. We are approaching my favorite street vendor. Hello. 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 We've come with the camera this time. Oh, really? Yes, yes. <laughs> All right. This lady's English is amazing. Oh, thanks very much. Yes, and she has the best uh, ban flan. Oh, thanks very much. Yes. Yeah. How long have you been here for? Oh, I think about uh, 30, 30 years and uh, cross month. Uh, yes. Oh, yes. 30 years and a cross month. 30 years and four months yes. you've been in this spot here. Yeah, that's right. And you. And selling ban flan for 30 yeah. years. No, but ban, ban, lang, ban lang, I think it took about 10 years. 10 years. 10 years. And ban bao. Ban bao. So she's actually got ban baos here and she has them inside here. Yeah. <laughs> okay, but we want to come for the ban flan. Uh -huh. Ban flan, yes. <laughs> but ban flan is my favorite Vietnamese uh, snack right now. And you can order, look very affordable so it's 8,000 per ban flan okay we will go for five is right. okay okay and it's okay we want to try one right here all right yes yeah, so we'll pull the camera uh -huh. okay and uh, but I, I tell you what you gotta be careful with your camera okay because sometimes you walk in the street and people <laughs> might steal the camera, yeah, steal your camera okay sure. i'll grab it really tight yeah, that's, that's, <laughs> You want a string to put in your hand? Ah, yeah. yes, I need to put <laughs> a better. string on my hand, yeah, yes. It's better, okay. it's better <laughs> yes. Put it in your body and you keep your hand in the hand. This is a good idea, yes. I need to get the strap for uh, my wrist. That's right. That's okay, right. thank you. Come on. Yeah, you gotta be careful, okay? Yes, yeah. I will. Like now or maybe tomorrow. Okay, <laughs> yes. All right. All right. So we're, gonna now. we're gonna have one now and then we'll take some afterwards with us. All right. Okay. You wanna put a glass or put some ice or a coffee or just a cup like that? What is the best way to have the bum plan? What's some, your favorite way? Yeah, some people really like some ice, some or not, but, but let's try, okay? Okay, let's yeah, just try it, yeah, let's ice. try it with ice, yeah. So, okay. What for you or, or just... We'll try one each. Yes. All right. Yeah. The, the idea, guys, is we're going to have uh, one each, and then I'm, I'm just going to buy like one of these packaged ones because I just store them in the fridge and I have them as a snack. Yeah. <laughs> I've come here almost every day, right? Uh -huh. Every I, almost yeah, every day I've come yeah. here because it's just so, so good. So good. Here, he come here every day. Yes. And I, I said uh, I'm gonna make a YouTube video and I'm gonna come visit you. Oh, okay. Yes. Oh, the coffee one. Yes, oh wow. Can be mine. Okay. Let's try. Just try. Okay. All right. So this is. Uh, oh, it's with uh, ice. Yeah. Oh wow. Okay. Ice for coffee. Yeah. Right. Perfect. So 
Uh, do you want to grab that? Uh, we're gonna take uh, some more when we go. We're gonna try this one, yeah? Okay, so guys, we have this ice version with coffee. So actually, she's put one of these uh, coffee packets. Yeah, there's coffee. Uh, ah, so she has the ice, ice and the coffee. Get a coffee, I put a bottle, and then you take a glass, and then you take away. Okay, for takeaway. Take away, except like that. So that's for the takeaway. Take away, yes. And, 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 and you put it in here, I put a bottle, and you put it in here. And you put it into here. Okay, so should we try this one out, Carolina? Yes. Do you want to come? Just, we're going to step down onto the street just here. Okay. We're good. We actually have the traffic right behind us. Okay. So. We've got the ice, the coffee, and the uh, ban flan. Okay. Oh, uh -huh, yeah. Every time we've been having it, we've just been having the small tubs. But we haven't been having it like this. This is really good. I think it looks amazing. Yeah, it's so good. I'm going to go into that again. So you can see on the... We'll be careful with the traffic, but... Uh, let's scoop that. Just like Very that. Very creamy. And with the coffee, it's perfect. Yeah, I'm gonna get some of that coffee. Woo. Amazing. Loving it. <laughs> really good. Oh my god, so good. I think my recommendation, it's really good. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But if you keep eating that in here, all right. But if you keep it Take it away? Yeah, it's it away. not good. Yeah, you can take yeah. it away. Oh, you can take it like this? Away like this, yeah. Mm -hmm. I like having this one here in the stall. And I like having this one at home. Okay. I'm like uh, watching YouTube and just eating uh, the bam flan. Okay. In bed. <laughs> In bed, yes. But I didn't worry. Yeah. Next time, gotta be careful. Your head. Yeah, yeah. I'll be I'll careful. I'll be careful. Right okay. I, 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 I'm afraid. I'm You're afraid. afraid. You're afraid. <laughs> I will grab it with my life. Okay. Should we take? Uh, can we take uh, five of these uh -huh. uh, to take away? Okay. Okay. Some coffee. Uh, maybe a bit of coffee. Yes. Yeah, for Perfect. the for the coffee lover, yeah. she loves coffee. She's okay, a... one book, uh, coffee for two cups. Okay, yes, let's right. do that. Let's do that. So how many you wanna get? Uh, five. five. Yes. I give you three because she likes. So I give you three, okay? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. she's no they're so nice. No problem. So uh, this lady, she's learned her English in a, uh, from Amer in America. Yeah. In, it was in America, or was it with an American guy? I'm not in, in, in America, but I'm, I'm stay, uh, I stay. I studied in Vietnam. You studied in Vietnam. Yeah. Uh, but the teacher teach me uh, from United States. He's American. Yeah, American. Yeah. And this was in 1970. Before 1975. Before 1975. Yeah, because before 1975, so a lot of foreigners in my country. Okay, a yeah. lot of Americans. The American are number first. <laughs> You're number one. Okay. <laughs> Hi, spoon. Uh, yes, some spoons are good. Um, America is number first, and after that. Australia. Okay. New Zealand. New Zealand. New Zealand. Yes. And uh, Korea. Korean. Philippines. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Yes. A lot in, in my country. You have a war. That's what happened. Oh yeah. yes. So after 1975, all of them back to the country. They all come. Yeah. Or oh, they go. Before, before. They go away. Okay. <laughs> okay. So uh, it is five, which is uh, uh, what? Six. Eight? Six. Oh yeah. Six. Oh yeah, including this one. I forgot about this one. 48,000. Oh, okay, we have some change just here. All right, come on. Come on. Yeah, Bank of England. So, so now where you go? go this one's ours? Yep. And then, We've got our package. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we are going... Can we take a picture together? Yes, can we take a picture with you? Of course. Okay. Yeah, we need to have this All right. So we've got our uh, bun flan ready for snacking. I comb my hair, I comb my hair. Are you going to comb your hair? Would you like her? <laughs> You're a special lady to us. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Thank you for the Do you want to show us the name? It's over here. Uh, so the name is? The name is a bun bao. Uh, for that dumpling, dumpling, inside of yeah. there, yes. Yeah. And okay. that's the address, right? So if you want to come find her, this is the address. Uh -huh. And you can get a beautiful ban flan or a bun bao. Yeah, it's a bun bao. It's better. It's bun bao is better? It's very, very good because I'm so very long time now, you know? Oh, because yeah. you've actually More been doing... More than 30 years. Oh, but even wow. people don't like I cannot sell all that long like that. Okay. Stop with it. <laughs> so we need to come back for bun bao, no, no, guys. No, no, no. We're going to do that. Oh, okay. Oh, bun bao is okay. All right. Thank you so much. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye. All right, guys, we hope you enjoyed this nightlife video here in Saigon. We have 
more, plenty more content coming your way for Vietnam. So do not forget to subscribe. We'll see you guys in the next video.